Hello dear Simnatics, and at request I am going to talk a little bit about regens, very briefly, give you some tips on how to find them, legally or illegally, let's just say, using a program or not. The program that I'm talking about is called GPF2, and it's available on the Champman website, and I'm going to make available here as well. But very, very briefly, what are what do we have to have in consideration on a regen? The regen, I'm not using here a regen example, I'm just saying that the regen always has the nationality, the preferred foot, the position, always, always common. These are the basic things that you can always see from the player, okay? And he is generated in this country of origin. By norm, I don't think there are exceptions. The guy is going to be generated where he's from. If he's English, going to be generated in England and so forth and so and so on, okay? When Aldo retires, send your scout into Portugal. Messi retires, send your scout into Argentina. And look for a guy with the same position, preferred foot, and nationality that you're looking for. Probably very, very young. If you can observe him, even better. There are four little attributes that are always common, always. They never, ever, ever change on a player, okay, throughout the game. And they are common always to the regen, to the old gen, to the whatever gen. It's always, they are always the same number, which are player, aggression, balance, and bravery. Balance, bravery, aggression, and flair are always 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 the same okay so i still have a guy here who recently retired we all know this character zlatan ibrahimovic so zlatan is a swedish guy with a right foot striker center balance bravery of 18 acceleration 15 and flare of 19 the uh, sorry aggression of 15 flare of 19 balance and bravery of 18 this shit is always common to zlatan ibrahimovic regen okay that i found here uh, where is he Maybe I didn't find him here. So let's find this guy, okay? Zlatan Ibrahimovic has just retired. And I am pretty sure that we're going to find his regen right there. And how are we going to do that really, really quickly? Right? Using this. If you want to cheat, if you want to make your game boring as fuck, whatever. But I know that a lot of you like it. So I'm just going to leave it there. Oh, Mario. It's so much easier like this. So, yeah. So as you can see here, for example, when I search here, this is the program itself, the GPF2 program that I was talking about and that I'm going to leave available here. So here's Zlatan Ibrahimovic. And since he still has his presence of himself in the game, you can find two names associated with him, which is Zlatan Ibrahimovic himself and Frederik Safari, okay? So let's check out that Frederik Safari in the game. Sec. Frederick Safari. Frederick Safari. Safari should do. No, there he is. Frederick Safari. 16 year old. Just generated there. He already did a game for an hour copying at 16. Right foot, striker center, Swedish. And if I scout him, I guarantee you that his flair, his aggression, his, his balance and bravery are exactly, exactly the same as Latin Zibrahimovic's. Make no mistake whatsoever. Other examples that we have around here. How to use this thing. Very easily. Very easily. So there's our program there. Let's see another guy. Diego Odin. So if you just press here, the guy, you will find the player. How do you use this program? Very easily. You check, you check, you use the potential ability here. Okay. So the better, the, the closer to 200, if you're not familiar with the CM Scout, but 200 is the maximum potential ability. And zero would be a shit player. I mean, there's not even zeros. I don't think so. So just go for like 150, 160, 160. Why not? Search for the guys and the list gets shorter and better. Of course, this is the quality that we're looking for. We got Robinho, Godin, Gia, Depayor, Alfabemi Martins, Nakamura, Dani Alves, Lisandro. So there's plenty of guys here. You just do this. You come here and you press the player. When you're doing this, and if you want this to work, there's a thing to have in consideration. In the game definitions, there are two things to have in consideration. In the game definitions, make sure that you save your games uncompressed, okay? Because otherwise you'll open the G GPF2 file and it will say that will only hope open or work with uh, uncompressed games. And usually if you have that compressed save file, compressed yes, if you have the yes ticked, you're fucked. It's not gonna work, okay? So, for example, you start a game, you save your save, okay? As soon as you start and you save your save, just open this program. Why? The GPF2 is going to take a snapshot 
of all the players in the database right there in the moment, okay? And then when you when you later go there, you do your game. Normally, you can close this shit. You don't have to be carrying this around, of course. You just make sure you save it uncompressed to save. And you open this as you create your game so it all the players will be there here on the GPF2. Like, you, the GPF2 will have all the players from the save there from the beginning. Otherwise, you will forget about a few or a new regen is going to be created. Then you have to wait for that regen to retire and you don't even know who the hell he is. Not by the original name anyway, okay? So just open this as you as you save your game the first time. That's it. Leave it. Go away. And if you're looking for a player or at a, a season later or, or whenever he retires, you just open open this again. You save your game normally. You just open this again, load your save here, and boof, the game will show you the differences from the Snapchat that you took in the beginning and the moment that you just reloaded the save. So anyone that retired and now has a different name and whatever will show here as these guys are. Peter Cech, Jan Pavlata, whatever, and so forth and so on, okay? It's a very, very easy way, a very, very cheaty way of using this. But if you want to be my guest, you can do this anytime you want. Very, very easy to use for sure. Just make sure that you save your game uncompressed and that you load this once in the beginning of the game. And then it doesn't matter. The game, whenever you come here, just go for potential ability and you will get whatever, whoever you desire. See if there's any one of these with 170. Probably there are a few. Some of these guys, Latin, for example, has more than 170 potential ability. I doubt he doesn't. I doubt loading, processing, I assume. Taking time, taking time. There they are. Okay. The remaining the remaining strong. Jean, Godin, Martins, Nakamura, Lisandro, Willy Caballero. So Willy Caballero, Federico Palacios. Let's check him out. And he will be in the country of origin in, in Argentina. Palacios. Where is he? Federico Palacios, goalkeeper, Argentino. Argentine Belgrano, there he is. Scout, I can't because it doesn't matter here. This Montreal save, I just chose a, a club and just let it rip in holiday mode. So I would get to this point and do this video that was requested by one of my followers there. So hope you guys enjoy this. Download the app if you want to download the app. You know how to use it now. It's super, super simple. If not, always have that in mind. The common four characteristics foot, nationality, position. With these things, you always have an idea if the guy's the regen or not. Okay? Adios, guys. Enjoy. Bye.